Do you see two people standing by the door? They look like spitting images of each other. Are they twins? But Paimon only sees one person there. <laughs> huh? Oh, how could that be? Uh, I guess my mind isn't as sharp as it used to be. Give me another Battle, boss. Uh, do you think she's drunk? There you go, miss. Oh my! It's not every day you get to see Granny Itzli here with some friends. Not to mention ones who've made a huge name for themselves recently. Oh, so you've heard of us? <laughs> of course I have. Aren't you the ones who saved Kachina and brought her back? No wonder you hit it off with Granny Sidlali. She wouldn't spend time with just anybody, you know. <sighs> I don't even remember the last time I saw her with a new friend. Wait, so you call her Granny too? Well, given our ages, it'd probably be more accurate for me to call her my great-great-granny. <laughs> She's one of the most famous people at the Masters of the Nightwind. Most days, hardly anyone even dares talk to her. Huh? Gossiping about me right in front of my face now, are you, Chanka? Oh, please, Granny. I wouldn't dare. I'm just beyond happy to see you bring over some new friends. After all, any friends of our regulars are sure to be great customers, too. All right, that's enough. Go on now. I'm sure the other customers would like to talk to you as well. There's no need to keep staring at me. I promise I'll keep my alcohol down until I leave. <laughs> well then, you have my thanks. Seat Lowie? Seat Lowie? Uh, who's that? Uh, you got some gall calling me by my first name. <laughs> uh, let me guess. You want to test your skills against Granny Eatsley, don't ya? Uh, are you still with the seat, Lolly? You're kind of talking to no one. Uh, you chumps come around here, picking fights with me. Well... You know what happens next. You lose, and then run off home to tell everyone about how I'm this big, scary bully. It's always the same story. You brats start it, I finish it, and then I end up with the reputation of being some kind of terrible monster among the shamans. I mean, come on. Monster? Me? Really? What did I do to deserve that? Granny C. Lolly, you're not a monster at all. Exactly! And while we're at it, I'm not some lazy slacker either. Between meditation, advising the chief, and speaking with the Wyab, I actually have a pretty packed schedule, you know! <laughs> oh yeah! And I have to mentor all the new kids! Hey, new kid! Yeah, you! Uh, don't play dumb. Didn't I teach you how to find Flo Justin? You see? I know my stuff. I'm a good teacher! You tell him! Oh, that's more like it! About dang time someone showed me a little respect. Yeah! Granny's a hard worker, all right. You can always rely on old Granny. <laughs> did, did she just fall asleep with her eyes open? Oh, jeez. Behind this pitch black curtain, a chapter of hatred reveals itself. Behind the smoke, the lingering smoke. 
Ah, she's meditating again. She does this whenever she's had a few too many drinks. Her mind's actually racing at this point. It's quite the opposite of sleep. Is this another specialty of the Masters of the Nightwing? No, I'd say it's an ability that's unique to Sitlali herself. While she can easily pick up everyone else's skills and tricks, few have been able to master hers. Warning, warning. Red, red, the color of danger, has now arisen within that pair of eyes. Huh? A <gasps> uh, traveler? Paimon? What's wrong? Uh, 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 I'm gonna hurl. Hang on, just keep it in. Uh, uh, uh phew. Okay, it's passed. Uh, that was a close one. You had Paimon worried. Paimon really thought you were about to barf all over the table just now. Ugh, how embarrassing. I'm sorry you had to see me like that. That's never happened before, I swear. I've never thrown up. Not once. <laughs> 